we are here we are back and we are playing jurassic world evolution and my god i know i'm late to the game i really i know it took a really long time taking a really long time to get this done probably i've done this at least i've tried to record the game since it's released at least five times it was all like all the errors for me it was nothing wrong with the game nothing wrong with my system it was just stuff that i that i was struggling with and, but the good news is i got it i've been working hopefully it's working right now it says it's recording so let's just get in this, yes. Just get in this. I, I was just, I thought, I was just playing this. Hello. I thought it was recording. It welcome. wasn't recording. My name is Dr. Ian Malcolm. You may have heard of me. Well, correction, you should have heard of me, especially now that you're here. So before you are the islands that you need to manage, if you can. The five deaths. Jeez, if only, if only there had been five. <laughs> okay, this is as good a place as any to begin. Isla Matanceros. It's relatively stable. Yeah, you can uh, you can get your feet wet here, and you should. Just diving into the deep end of the pool is where the big, angry, hungry things are, and uh, you want to be ready before you try that. I'm Cabot Finch, public relations and crisis management, and I'm here to help you. You'll start by building a Hammond creation lab. Okay. We've yeah. already started on an enclosure for you. You should just attach it to the side, but watch out for dinosaurs. <laughs> ah, just kidding. <laughs> I was wondering why the recording was allowing me to go so long. I was like, I could have sworn, because I watched a couple of my... I didn't watch them, but I looked at, like, my gallery. Let's focus on what Let's you're here to do, video. which is create dinosaur facilities on the islands we call the Five Deaths. Actually, Las Cinco Muertes, <laughs> because Spanish is the lingo of choice around here. I, got, I was looking at my gallery to look at the videos that were flawed because there was no audio. You'll need to connect it to the pre-existing network of paths and the power grid. And they were like 15 minutes long, like the recording was only allowing me to get a 15 minute video in, which is fine, because that's my typical length for a video. Now comes the real test, incubating a dinosaur. You'll start with a Struthiomimus. Select the creation lab and pick a hatchery bay. There's enough genome data for your first viable dinosaur. But I was like, this one... The machinations of the blood. ambitious. Undoing extinction, playing with nature's laws, what can possibly go wrong? Come on, Doctor. You know we've learned so much, and invested even more in our Jurassic operations since the last time. Yes, Mr. Finch, yes, the, the last time. There's always a last time, and a next. Life, it begins. The most precious moment, the result of incalculable actions and reactions, trials and errors, genetic mutations and unknowable combinations, chaos, all leading to a living, breathing, thinking being, an entity, distinct and unique. And now we, you, just manufacture them. So, well done. I guess. Yeah, I was looking at the audio and everything else. The Hammond Foundation has three main areas of interest. Security, entertainment, and science. I've already nudged the heads of each division to reach out to you personally. 
They'll offer opportunities and incentives for you to be part of their team. Choose one of their contracts. It'll help you develop your facility. Are you gonna go security? This is Lambert, head of security. Yours, theirs, and mine. Welcome to the islands. So here's our basic conundrum. We want to keep our animals under control while simultaneously encouraging instinctive behaviors because these animals have potential as combatants. Look, everyone's fear object, myself included, is to have these animals running free and loose in the park. But we can't exploit them globally without taking some chances. Contracts can be requested from the division heads inside the control room. Complete these to increase your reputation and gain additional revenue to keep expanding your park. So, one more thing. Your reputation. Your rep, quote-unquote. Keep an eye on it, okay? If you have a solid reputation with a division, you're more likely to benefit from them. Financially, I mean. But, like life, it's a balancing act. Each division is vying for your attention, and if they don't get it, they tend to take it personally. Okay, now it's allowing me to look around and stuff. So, fossils. Well Sorry. done! Dang, and you'll notice really absolutely well. no hint of sarcasm. Unless you listen real closely. <laughs> So, what I meant to say is that completing that contract has raised your standing, your reputation, if you will, with the security division. This means they'll be willing to give you more difficult missions. First mission. Thank you. Lambert here. I've got a new assignment that I think is perfect for your skill set. Give it a once over, then. Let me know if you're interested. So this is pretty easy. Glad to have you on board. As you can imagine, the animals in the various facilities are constantly probing for weaknesses in our security systems. They're smarter and more devious than people give them credit for. But I refuse to underestimate their capabilities. That's why I'm always testing and evaluating our security protocols and barriers. This is where you come in. I've got to give this guy Lambert his due. He actually sees these animals as both opportunity and threat. I'm going to need you to extract enough DNA from fossils to incubate and hatch a dinosaur. This is the first phase of this mission. Carry okay. on. Good. Your first expedition team is out. They'll bring back what they find to the fossil center for extraction. Hungry? Oh. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Uh... Your job is simple, really. Create dinosaurs which attract visitors to your facilities, brings in capital, money, huh? Bam. Which means you can do more research to build better facilities and create more dinosaurs, and there you go. A circle of life, development and resources, nature and commerce. See? Simple. I could have sworn we already did this, but security. We don't always get offers oh. like this. Consider it carefully. Ah. Uh, we're going to have to decline that one because one, we don't have a ranger station yet, and two. As much as I love my Struthiomimus, I don't think a picture is going to be worth five grand. As much as I love them. But wait, uh, I'm not sure. Uh, all adjustable carbon dinosaurs. Except the Indoraptor. Yeah. All, almost all adjusted carbon dinosaurs so far are female, and I believe Frontier did say that all dinosaurs here are female, so. As much as I love her. I don't think it's possible right now. As much as I really wish it was. How close are we? Okay, they're about there. They're on their way back right now. The research center lets you improve your park in various exciting ways. 
New buildings, upgrades, and more await. More sediments, I was gonna buy, go by really fast. You should extract genomes from fossils that have been collected inside your fossil center. That will increase the amount of viable data you have to create dinosaurs. Probably something I should have. Especially since that's gonna be a part of the mission here in a minute. I'm gonna wait. Oh, no, we're just gonna get it right here, that way we have it. Like I said, I was just trying to record, but like, it wasn't recording. I got, like, it was annoying, because I had to reset my recording and the island and everything. And it's recording now, but it's like, oh my god, it was so annoying. This should place us well over 50. Research completed. Because yeah, it wouldn't have gone by that fast. Because it knows that's a part of the mission that we're doing. It would not have gone by that fast. Because you see, this is taking a long time. It's going, that's going by fa slower. But faster. I do actually want to work a bit on these. Well. Okay, next you'll need to incubate the animal in a Hammond Creation Laboratory before releasing and housing it in an enclosure. You'll yeah, also want to make sure thing. we've got an ACU presence on this island. Yeah, that's what I was doing. One, two buildings as close together as humanly possible, and it looks like it's best I'm going to get. That way we room for the path to put in here. Okay. I, mean, I seriously love this animation. I think that is so cool. Okay, so then Mossos is incubating. How close is this thing? almost halfway done. I mean that's fine. As soon as that gets finished we're gonna release the we're gonna wait no we still need to even incubate it. Hold on, I'm sorry. finish and it's about to finish right now. This next bit is gonna sound a little crazy because frankly, it is. But we are gonna encourage one of the dinosaurs to breach our containment grid. We'll then react and see if our procedures and personnel are up to the challenge. Yes. So at this point, I'd like to take back everything I just said about this guy. <laughs> Asset containment this. unit should be your first port of call to bring down a rampaging dinosaur. Is it even out yet? Oh, it's right there. Alright. As soon as he gets out of the gate. Visual on the asset. Okay, we have our runner. Time to tag him and bag him. We're using less than lethal, but remember, that dinosaur doesn't know this is just supposed to be a drill. So watch your back. While I understand yeah. the need to keep our security as sharp as possible, oh, this is not the way I would go about doing it. You have a problem with